Hey y'all. My name is Holly. Welcome back to my channel. Hello. My name is Kayla. <laughs> Welcome back to her channel too. <laughs> so we are out shopping today and we are doing a fall haul. We're so excited. Um, we're going to be going into at home, Target, Marshalls, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, like everywhere. Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby. There's some thrift lot. stores, um, antique stores. So we're going to try to cram everything into one video. So we'll just show y'all bits and pieces of what we got. I'm probably even going to, but when we get back to your house show them what you got because she's going to be getting a lot of stuff too and i want y'all to be able to see what both of us get so let's go get started if you love these kind of videos don't forget to give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button and then also follow me um on instagram and kayla on instagram i'll put our instagram accounts down below because we do these kind of things all the time and we show what we're doing and what we're getting on our stories so you get to see more of us on our instagrams too First, we're looking at fall clothes before we look at fall decorations. Because we got to Target to get Starbucks. And we couldn't come here without looking at their clothes because they have so much cute things. I saw this on a home tour yesterday. It was by that eclectic Kristen. If you don't follow her, she has some really cute stuff. And she had this in her kitchen. And she said she got it on the Facebook yard sale, but they had it at Target. And I wanted it so bad. It's going to be so pretty for fall. I'm here whenever I was in here with mom, oh. Caleb Outfield. Remember we came in here with mom last week? I didn't even want to look at the fall because I knew I was bringing Kayla in here to look at the fall. So we're back home. We're at Kayla's. I'm about to show y'all what she got and then I'm gonna go home and film mine. This is the trunk. This is the back seat. We have so many goodies to show y'all. Hey y'all, so we're back in my house and I was gonna show y'all what I got today. Holly's gonna show you hers when she gets home. We just unloaded mine, so I wanted to show y'all this. So. This came from Marshalls. Should I take it out or can they see it well enough? I'll take it out. There are two pillows for a good deal. So here's this pillow. It's a, what did you call this, Holly? A burnt orange color? Yes. It's so pretty. It's got the detail in it. We got two of these for my I'm bedroom. I'm obsessed with those. And then this came from Hobby Lobby. This is to drape over our bed on our headboard. I thought it was gorgeous. Holly helped pick that out. Y'all notice we got the fireplace going in the background for y'all too. The heat is not on. Yeah, you can have the fire going without the heat. It's really pretty. This is just for effect. <laughs> yes. And here's the receipt. And Target, I got this really pretty rug. I'm hoping for, for it to go in my kitchen. It's gorgeous. Got the mustard yellow in it. Oh man, I love that rug. I thought I was going to get it, but I didn't need a rug. So I talked to Kayla into it. You're welcome, Austin. This is good. Austin gets to see all the things. Save all my receipts. And then in here, 
I got this super cute top from Marshalls. I'm just grabbing bags, y'all. There's so much. I got this super cute top top from Marshalls. Maybe I can wear it to our mountain trip. Thought it was Love cute. that. The print is so pretty. It's so light. I'm very hot natured and it can be, be really good to layer. Another Target bag. We were super excited about this fine. We got both of these on clearance. This super cute little tank. Bring up to only $12. And then as we were going to check out, Holly found this. And I love me a cardigan. It's going to look super cute with this. But it's this gorgeous burnt orange burnt orange cardigan it was only $15 and it's a long one I love that one so much where I work we wear t-shirts every day so that'll be fun to dress it up with that okay then I got these super cute picks these are to go in a wreath that I have in my kitchen to kind of decorate it we love this one this one was Holly's favorite because I had the acorn and the berries in it yeah I love that one Y'all, I don't know if y'all can tell this or not about Caleb. I can hear it in her voice. She's exhausted. <laughs> what time did we leave? Like 9 o'clock? And it's 7 o'clock. We left at like 9 o'clock this morning and it's now 7 o'clock. She's Aww. usually all peppy and all and I can tell she's trying to be, but Aww. you're exhausted, aren't you? Yeah, I'm tired. I hope it's it doesn't sound that bad. I'm excited. I'm just really tired. No, I was just telling them because... Um, I don't know if they noticed it or not, but y'all, we are worn out. We have shopped till we literally and Holly's today. nowhere near done. She helped me load the stuff in my house, and then we're showing what all I got. And then she's got to go home and show y'all everything she got. And yeah, I told Kayla. There's a lot said, that goes into this. Yeah, a lot that goes into these YouTube videos. Yes. So if y'all love them, please hit that subscribe button. I've got a hair in my mouth. Sorry, y'all. This is beautiful. Bloopers. <laughs> okay. Next, I got this super cute bag. If you haven't noticed, my favorite color is army green. I have it on right now. I love army green. Um, it's just a big, pretty bag. It's got a zipper inside, and then it has this big bag in it, too. I'm so obsessed with this bag. I love it. It even has, I don't know if you saw this, Holly, but it's got compartments and zippers in here as well. And it was only like $20, nice. wasn't yes, it? Yes, it was $20. This is so I nice. love the tassel. This is perfect. And if I love a big bag. I throw everything in my bag. So I'm super excited to use this. It'll be good for like a laptop and a um, iPad too from Kirkland's. All their rugs were $10. So I got this Hello Pumpkin for $10. So cute. I love it. And then in here, I also got this to go over our bed holly found this we were going to check out and i said i really need something different fall to go over our bed so i thought this was perfect she's doing blue and orange navy blue and orange in her room for yes. it's cute all this is for my bedroom actually so i got this it has the navy blue in it with the burnt orange and mustard yellow it was only 25 dollars, and y'all it is so soft so pretty and then i got this little guy to go in my bedroom as well on a little um little bed and breakfast tray um it's got the leather yep so it's grateful and it's I just a pretty that. blue okay also from target i got these cute little black shoes this will be perfect for transitioning into fall i just got it we got a few little clothing pieces so there's those were those. on clearance too yeah i think they're only 15 dollars and then i got this active little cover up our little dress i thought it was really cute yes i love that a black dress. it's a good material <laughs> it's very cooling hey they just keep coming the yeah. bags and then this came from home goods holly helped me with this i had no idea what i wanted to get but this is a little arrangement um i think i'm gonna put it in my master bathroom i have a galvanized holder in there with lots of cotton i think i want to mix this with the cotton because if y'all have seen my house before i love some cotton we had that all at my wedding so i love to incorporate it for the season so i thought this was really pretty or holly did i told her i needed something so she helped me with it and then last thing came from home goods as well it's these sweet pie pumpkin pie coffee um, little curry cups. 
and I thought they would be super cute on my coffee bar this year when I decorate it. That's so cute. And I can drink them I too. love how they say sweet pie on it. And then right here. Do you know what that is? I didn't know. Sprinkles. We couldn't remember what all we got today. <laughs> yeah. They're little fall leaf sprinkles. And I thought that would look good on my um, coffee bar as well. Just to incorporate some color. It'll be cute to put on some whipped cream on some coffee. Oh, yes. Red hot cocoa. Is that all? I think so. And we got some stuff for my husband. Some shirts for my husband and um, things like that. But this was all the stuff that I got for me. I'm going to stand up and show y'all the mess in here. Good morning. So, y'all, this is the next day after our shopping experience. I was so tired last night, and it was dark when I got home. And I was just like, I'm not going to show myself. The, the lighting's not going to be good. I'm not going to be excited because I'm so tired. So, I was like, I'm just going to get up in the morning, pile everything around me, which you can kind of see some little bits and pieces everywhere because I couldn't get everything out of the camera shot, y'all. Like, this is the best fall haul ever. Like, this has got to be the best um fall haul on a youtube channel like there is so much stuff so we're gonna get right into it but let me tell y'all this so i went yesterday and i had in my mind i'm just gonna go because i don't know if your stores are like this right now but like tj maxx home goods those kind of stores that we absolutely love and can find different things they have like nothing right now and i don't know if it's just because maybe it's august or what but I'm thinking maybe September, October, they might put some more stuff out. I don't know if it's because of the pandemic with the world that's going on. But my thoughts were, okay, I'm just going to buy anything that I like. Anything that's fall that I love, I'm going to buy it and bring it home with me. I'm going to decorate my whole house and whatever I don't use, I'm going to take it back. That way I don't have to make trips back and forth, back and forth like what I usually do. And I just thought this would be a lot easier instead of decorating the whole house, needing to go grab a few things, coming back home, using those, needing to go back. So I'm just hoping and praying that this is going to be the ticket this year. Just to have bought everything that I loved, get it home with me, and start decorating. So, now you know why this is going to be the biggest fall haul. I mean, there is so much stuff. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get started. And we're not, like, going to start with anything in particular. We're just going to start grabbing as we go. So we'll start with this because I know y'all can see this stuff first. I told y'all I wanted to get a cute mug. Actually, I probably need to get it closer so I can show y'all detail. So I got this cute mug. This is the only mug that I found that I absolutely loved yesterday. There's another one out there that I never grabbed whenever I was out and about before. And I want to get it. I can't remember where it's from, actually. So I'm going to tell y'all. It's like a um, rust color and the inside is buffalo plaid. And I think that it says... I know it says something about fall, but I can't remember exactly what I thought that it said. Anyway, but it's really cute. I know at Kirkland's they had like a grayish mug and the inside had buffalo plaid. Um, plaid, but I'm wanting the rust colored one. Anyway, so this is the only one that I bought yesterday. So here's this mug. I got it from Hobby Lobby, and I loved the little detail, and then the terracotta. So, that's the only mug that I got yesterday. And sorry if I look white and washed out. I'm using my new camera. I don't even know if I've told y'all this or not, but I did get a new camera to film with. I'm not using my phone anymore. So I got the Canon M50. And if you have any questions, you can message me down below. But I did get a new camera, and I'm loving the quality of it so far. So handy. But I haven't gotten used to, I have not got used to all the settings yet. Anyway, so this is the second thing that I bought, or another thing. This is what I'm going to use, I'm thinking, for my um, Aria diffuser from Young Living. I think I'm going to use it in my master bathroom. Love the detail. And I got this from a little local, um kind of like antique furniture shop. It's called Encore. It's in Pelham, Alabama. Anyway, so I grabbed this. I also got some earrings from there. And I only got these because I had like this kind of a gift card type thing. And I had like two more dollars on it. So I grabbed these cute little hoop earrings that were $11. And I love me some gold hoops. So I grabbed those. Y'all, this video, it's just going to be too long. So I'm not doing a bunch of editing. I am just going to they're on sale, probably bloopers. Then I got these from Rustic Relics. Now, these I did not get yesterday, but I thought I would throw in a couple of things that I got for fall um, last week. Just because I wanted to share it with y'all. So, I got these. 
and they're just amber bottles that I'm wanting to use. The idea is to use them in the bathroom. I love this one. Addison picked it out for me. It looks like a little, it has little pumpkins on it. The next thing that I'll pull is this. This is for Maddie and Jeff. Everybody got prizes yesterday. Drew got some prizes. I won't show his. I got him some shirts at TJ Maxx, but I thought these were cute. So I got Maddie and Jeff just some treats from TJ Maxx or Home Goods. And then I thought this was so cute. It is um, cute little fall donuts, and then it says pumpkin spice ruffuccino, I think is what it said. Yeah, pumpkin spice ruffuccino fuzzy yard brew. So I grabbed that for them to play with during the fall season. What else? Okay, next, I was watching Eclectic Kristen's Home Tour. I think I talked about this in Target. And she had this rug, and y'all was obsessed. I'm ready to roll this out. I think I'm going to put this in my kitchen for the fall season. And I love the burnt orange colors that it has. It has some browns, some teals, greens. It's just gorgeous. So you can tell it has the little fringes. And it is, here's the information on it. It's a runner, and how big is it? 28 by 84 so I loved this rug so much and I cannot wait to put it out after this video I'm actually going to start cleaning my house because if you follow me on Instagram then you have seen the house I showed y'all last night and y'all it is so messy it is so messy there's stuff everywhere so when I finish this video, I'm going to edit it and start uploading it. Everything, I think I'm going to actually start decorating for fall. I thought I was going to wait next week, but during I was going for our anniversary trip this weekend, and I thought I was going to get back and decorate, but I think I'm going to go ahead and decorate this week real fast, just throw a few things up. That way, I just get some things out of the way, cleared out, and just, I just, I honestly just can't wait to start decorating. And I want to be able to see what I'm able to take back if I need to order anything, because I plan on doing my fall home tour in the middle of September. So I want to make sure that I'm prepared. Another thing I purchased from Kirkland's is this beautiful vase. I love the blue and white stuff. Um, it looks so good for spring. Um, really every season you can make these work. And I've seen them with fall, fall with beautiful arrangements in it. And I wanted this for my four year. I wanted an urn, more probably like a concrete urn. But whenever I saw this one, I thought it would be gorgeous with a lot of the fall florals that I have picked for this year. So this is a big piece. Really love it. Um, like I said, this one is from Kirkland's. I'm not going to link everything down below. I'm just going to tell you where I got things and then maybe they'll have it at your store. But this one was like $40 and y'all that was a good deal because this is massive. So pretty. On this side now. Another thing that I got from Rustic Relics was this beautiful pillow. Y'all know that I love me some green. It's velvet. I want a bunch of pillows like this with the ruffled edge that's velvet. And I cannot find them anywhere. Okay, I'll take that back. I did find one at this place near me uh, called Clear Furniture Market. We've taken y'all there before, Kaylin, on a Tuesday. The pillow was $300. And it was beautiful. It was a long lumbar pillow, lumbar pillow, and it was burnt orange and was velvet. Gorgeous. No way was I dropping $300 on that. So I found this one at Rustic Relics for $16 this at the thrift store yesterday it's a little copper plate i don't know where i'll use it i thought it'd be pretty to use to like put cookies or something on for the um new season it was 4.99 it has some beautiful detail to it oh look you can see the camera thought it was very pretty and i loved this one it doesn't have the legs like i said but um I figured I could use it somewhere. I just really like getting these little pieces. They dress up an area, and I think they're so pretty styled for fall, Christmas, really each season. Uh, okay, next, we'll go with these. Get these out of the way. I got some of these florals. Remember in my last haul video, or one of my last ones? What's going on? Okay, one of my last videos, I got yellow. And these from Kirkland's, well, I decided to go ahead and grab the two orange, too, just because, like I said, I want to have everything right ready to go so I can decorate and then take back. So, y'all, I think this is a genius plan. Y'all comment down below and let me know if y'all have ever done this before. I think it's so much better than having to go back and forth, back and forth everywhere. So, grabbed these. 
so pretty. And then, um, these are some thrift store items also. I grabbed this. And I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. It's brass. It has the legs. Look at that cute little acorn on the top. So, I'm going to clean it up a little bit. Like I said, said I don't know for sure what I'm going to be doing with it yet. But, I thought it was so cute for fall season. Because I had the little acorn. Okay, next. I got this from um, an antique store. What else did I get from the thrift store? I got a few more things. Anyway, I got this from an antique store. I really wanted a copper one, but I couldn't find one. And this one was gorgeous. I've never seen a brass one. I got this one for $18. And my plan is to put this... Let me just show you. This is my, my plan. Okay, so I grabbed this also. I actually grabbed two of these. One of them is way bigger, and I'm going to try to sell it because it's not what I needed. Anyway, so this one... Is what I was looking for, a wicker basket. And my plan is to put this on my island with this on top of it. This came from an antique store also. Same place as this. And put that on top of it. Put my scale, my old scale here with like a um, bowl of apples and something else on here. And fill this full and just beautiful of fall florals. Isn't that going to be so pretty? So I grabbed those two. These are just little things. I grabbed these two sprinkles. I loved the containers that they were in. So this one is for fall, and I thought it'd be cute by the coffee bar. Why is it not focusing? There we go. Grab this for the coffee bar. It has the little leaves in it. Thought it'd be cute for my hot cocoa. And then this one, I love the little containers, like I said. This one has ghost and black and white sprinkles. And I thought this would be really pretty for Halloween, sitting on a coffee bar. So I grabbed these two. I got something Halloween. This is really the only other thing Halloween. I got this for Darla, my little mannequin in the kitchen, and she's never, I usually dress her up as a cute little witch, she's never had an apron for Halloween, so I saw this one and thought we'd put her on an apron this year, so I grabbed this from Home Goods. it's a little wrinkly, it says witch's brew, I don't really know what all it says on it, it's backwards reading it in the camera, but I love the black, like my favorite for Halloween is black and white striped, and some orange. So this was $10 at Home Goods. So Darla will be so cute this Halloween. A pair of these shorts. We're going to Disney World for a weekend. Addison's going, my, Addison's my sister-in-law by the way. She's going for a hair extension class because she's a cosmetologist. And there's one out that way. It's like who the celebrities get there. It's like the ones that the celebrities use. I don't know. Anyway, so we're going out there and it's in Orlando. So we're going to spend two days at Disney during Halloween. So pumped about that. I cannot wait. Y'all, my like big dream and thing I want to do, I wanted to do it this year, but they're not having the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party. So I'm hoping to do it next year. But I want to go October 31st, be at Magic Kingdom, October 31st for Halloween, go to sleep, wake up, go back to Magic Kingdom November 1st because they said that they transform Disney from Halloween into Christmas overnight. There's actually a video or something that comes on the TV on the channel Freeform and it is like showing you how they do it and it's awesome i watch it every year anyway so we're going to disney world and so i grabbed these biker shorts i got them at tj maxx for ten dollars and they're very pretty i love the black on black with the cheetah print i want i'm wanting some camouflage too but this one has some pockets so i grabbed these and i found some really cute t-shirts um that i'm getting made for me to wear to disney with them I might wear leggings, so it depends on how cold it is, but I just really like these, so I grabbed these, too. They're only $10. Okay, the next two items are going to be clothes, because that's what's next. I grabbed these shoes. They were on sale at Target for $25. I think they were last year's little clogs, but um, that's why they were on clearance, but I love them. They're so comfortable. So cute. These can dress up an outfit. Oh my gosh, I just love them. So you just slip them on. You don't wear socks with them. And like I said, $25. So cute. The next thing I got at Target was, I probably paid a little bit too much for this, honestly. Kind of upset about it, but I've been looking for one this color and I haven't been able to find one that was cheaper than um, $10. So I grabbed this and I love wearing these tied around my neck or in my hair and I love burnt orange for fall. So, 
got this one. Like I said, it was $10. It was a little pricey for a bandana. Usually you can get them for like a dollar at Walmart, but they just don't have this color. So that's an accessory piece. We went to two different Targets, by the way, yesterday. You have to go to a few different stores, like at the same stores to find different things. So we go like an hour out of the way and make our way back home to go to all these stores to find all these things. So I got this little cardigan. I thought it'd be so cute, even for spring, summer, but I love this blue for fall. And I, I just, y'all, I think my favorite material is crushed velvet. I just love velvet. It's so soft. And so I grabbed this. This is a one size fits all. I got this from Target, like I said. I'll show you the detail. Next, this is the last clothing item. I think I got tongue tied. I got this for $16.99 at Marshall's. This is the only thing I bought at Marshall's. It's a long cardigan. It's got slits up the side or maybe that's the back. Yeah, slits on the back and it's sleeveless. Y'all, this is going to be so classy and cute. Like, where's my shoes? Some leggings and like a cute shirt with my little clogs. It's going to be so cute and simple. Whoops. I'm going to show you the material. It's like a pretty heather gray sweater material. $16.99. Okay, next, this piece right here is what I thought I was going to put for the kitchen island. Y'all, it's massive. Whenever I got it home, well, I saw that other piece, and I was like, that piece is more what I was looking for. But I was like, this piece would be beautiful hung up on a wall somewhere. So if I can't find a place to hang it up on the wall that's going to look right, I think I'm just going to have to sell this. Because I can't take this back. This place was like a no refund place. Y'all, I'm like nervous right now because... I've never filmed this long of videos on my camera and I gotta put them from my phone from my camera to my phone to edit and I'm like this is gonna take a while. I hope that like is recording me because I can't see if it is or not. So I hope I'm not doing all this for nothing. I had to redo it. So I got this blanket. I love this rust and burnt orange. I grabbed this from Target. It's just like a what material is this? Polyester. Super soft. Y'all, you are going to die whenever y'all see all these blankets that I got. Okay, so then I got this one at Target. And this is a huge cable knit blanket. So gorgeous. I love this one. My plan is to put this one on the end of our bed. I need to speed this up. Anyway, so I grabbed this. I grabbed these two at Kirkland's because I saw a picture on Pinterest where they put these like folded on top of a trunk. And I have an old trunk in my bedroom. So I grabbed these two. I loved the colors of these. I got this from Target, and I think I'm going to put this on the end of our bed. I don't know. I'm going to play with it today and see. Like I said, I don't know if I'm going to be keeping all this or not. But I grabbed this throw. This is from Magnolia. Was it Hearth and Hand Collection? And it's a King Comforter, and it's gray and white striped. It's got the little black stitching. I've loved this one for a while, but I didn't need it. But now I'm thinking it could really kind of help warm up our space for fall season and Christmas. And I mean, heck, I could use it all year long. I don't know what I'm saying. But this one, loved it. So I grabbed it. Okay. I'm running out of space to stack things. I told y'all, this is the longest haul. Best fall haul. Y'all let me know. Have y'all seen anybody else that showed this much stuff on their page? <laughs> Because I have not seen it. This one, I knew whenever we went out shopping, I was like, this is going to be the best fall haul ever. Grab these candlesticks for my mantle. I grabbed these candlesticks to go on my fireplace mantle because I'm changing that up just a little bit. So I grabbed those. And I grabbed this candle. I need a lantern on my fireplace. Got this from Hobby Lobby. It was 50% off. And it's a huge LED candle. Actually, now that I'm looking at that, I hope that, that fits in there because it's kind of skinny at the bottom, but we'll see. Okay, next I grabbed this for Drew. I'm not even opening it up because honestly it just feels nasty and I want to clean it. But it's an old fishing tackle box. I got it for $4 and I thought he would like this and it was really cute and old. So, I'm going to put that down. That feels nasty. Ugh. Okay, this is my fall florals that I got to try out. I've been wanting to get these from Hobby Lobby. And they were $12.99 and 40% uh, off. But... They're so pretty. They're like tree branches. So I grabbed two of them. Don't know where I'm putting them yet, but I loved them and been wanting them for the fall. I also got this garland from Hobby Lobby. 
which I think I should draw a close up while we're in there. This is making a mess. So this is the one that I'm wanting to put over my headboard. And I'm getting some really, really cute signs made from Varied Grace Designs. And I'll give you a hint, they're like bed and breakfast signs. And it's gonna be reversible. So the front side of it's gonna be bed and breakfast for autumn and the back side of it, I can flip it and it's gonna be bed and breakfast for Christmas or like winter themed. Cannot wait to show y'all those, but that'll be in another video. But that's gonna go over my headboard is the plan. Okay, oh, and then I got this from Target, Target. Y'all, this was a beautiful little wreath. Y'all know that I really like using like real um, florals and like preserved florals, but I love this color. And I think this is gonna go around my cow head dolly um, on my vent hood in the kitchen. But this was, uh, I thought it was Magnolia but it's not, it's by threshold. I only found a shelf for our master bathroom between our mirrors. And I think it's gorgeous. Kayla actually helped me find it. Found it at an antique store. It's so pretty. And I'm actually gonna paint it some because as you can see, it's got some gold to it. And even though I think the gold detail is pretty, pretty, I don't want it to be gold. I want to paint it and really rough it up. Um, to make it work for the space that I'm wanting to do. So, I got this, and I know you can't see, I can't back it up, oh, hold on. Perfect, so I grabbed the shelf, and this is my plans. I can't wait to paint this and get it hung today. Please say that this is gonna fit. Nope, nope. So I, that's why I grabbed these little amber bottles because I thought these would be so pretty and make this kind of fallish for the master bathroom. And I was going to put leaves in it, but I'm not going to be able to as you can see. So I'll just put a few of these amber bottles in here and I think it's going to be gorgeous. Okay, so that's all for the fall video today. I hope that y'all enjoyed that. I hope that was enough for y'all. Goodness gracious, I have a mess all around me. I cannot wait. Like I'm so anxious about stopping this video, editing it, and then being able to clean up and start decorating with some of this stuff. Um, and really just getting the house back in order because, gosh, it, it's terrible. Anyway, y'all comment down below. Let me know if y'all love these kind of videos. What was your most favorite thing that I found? If you have any questions, just ask me in the comments below. Again, if you don't already, please follow me on Instagram at Simply Lake and Lace. You get to see behind the scenes of what's going on. You get to see my house completely destroyed whenever I bring all this stuff home. And then today I'm going to be showing some sneak peeks on my Instagram on how I'm putting some of this stuff up. So if you follow me on Instagram, you get a little behind the scenes um, on my story. So y'all be sure to check that out. Don't forget to please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Y'all cannot express y'all how much it means to me whenever y'all hit that subscribe button. It takes a lot of work. Um, like I said, you saw me and Kayla yesterday, how exhausted we were um, just going through and filming and making these videos. It's more than just shopping. Like, you have to film, then you have to get home and record everything and then edit the video. Like, it's a lot. But I am so thankful for this job that I was able to have, and I love sharing with you guys. So, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And also, Miranda Christine, we decided to do a collab together. Y'all know that we do collabs all the time and sometimes it'll be last minute like this time. I called her yesterday, told her what all I got. She told me she went to the exact same stores, got a lot of things. So we were like, okay, well we're gonna do a collab. So after this video, don't forget to go to her collab from um, yesterday. They'll be, both be posted tonight. Don't forget to hit subscribe to her channel. We have like the same style. We love going and finding like unique things and little treasures at the thrift stores, everything. We have so many fun videos planned for fall. Like September, me and her both have our calendars and like planned for what we were going to be filming for y'all. It's going to be so awesome. Again, thank y'all so much for following along and I appreciate y'all more than y'all know. I love sharing for you guys and I hope that y'all have a very blessed rest of your weekend and I'm praying that the Lord blesses y'all abundantly through this new season that we're about to journey into and I love you all and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye y'all.